planning isn't the best, but we are mostly moved out. I always feel like, and you guys tell me if this is true or not, even if you hire movers, there's always like a little bit of straggler items. But I think we've got most of the big stuff, which is really what was the most important to me, but we're gonna have to make a few trips to get everything cleared out because we do go to Italy for a week and a half coming up and we gotta, our 30 days is up literally just before then. It's up on the 22nd and we leave on the 24th or 23rd because we have to leave um, out of San Francisco airport. So we gotta drive down the night before but uh, we're trying to get everything out of here so we can turn in our keys and everything before we leave on a trip. So it's just like a crazy, crazy time. All of that stuff. So yeah, I just figured I would show you guys the emptiness and I'm, I've been in my new place for a couple days and I never thought I'd feel like this, but I don't know, like you guys tell me, like it's hard for me, for me to adjust to change, even though it's like super positive all of that i'm just like everything is just happening at once um and for those of you who have been following me i've been to this in another video i have been dealing with a mistaken identity i've been getting mail for this other girl who shares my name different middle name so my husband and i just started the process of um both of us changing not really changing our last name we um i talked about changing my last name to his and so what we ended up deciding to do together is we're gonna add on each other's last names so I'll have four names um, he kind of wanted to hyphenate but I guess they do it in their system like Social Security they hyphenate in their system but it shows up as like two names so I hope by adding on his last name I won't be getting Mail for this other girl anymore and my husband you know he just decided he wanted to go through it with me so he added on my last name um, so I thought it was really cool and for this, this is kind of off topic but I initially was never really a big fan of like the traditional name change and it's funny when we were at the social security office the gal was really surprised. I guess they just don't have it happen very often where the guy changes his last name after marriage. And granted, we've been married 13 years and we weren't sure if we we're gonna have to go to court to change our last names. Thankfully we didn't, but she did have but she did have to double check the legalities around him changing his last name just because here in the US, for those of you who are outside the US, it's very common for the woman to change her last name, but the guy seldomly does but he wanted to and in the state of California they recognize the guy's uh, or the husband's legal right to change his last name whether it be to his, the wife's name or to add on her last name or just to change the last name to something completely different because I've seen people do that they'll take both their last names and they'll create their own unique last name I don't think that would have really worked for my husband and I, you know, with our last names. And we have short last names, so it's not really a big deal to have four names. It's not like we, our names are really long. But we started that process, and once we get back from our trip, we'll probably go to the DMV and finalize that. Um, and it'll be done after 13 years. <laughs> but I just think it's the best decision for us. Um, if I had to change my last name, I just think this is the perfect way that we ended up deciding to do it together. And it's almost like, I don't know, like it's almost like, you know, like we've renewed our vows, I think once or twice. And it's almost kind of like getting married all over again, just with, you know, getting a new home together, changing our last names together. It's almost like we're starting a whole new life. I don't know, that's what it feels like. So I'm just so overwhelmed with everything going on. Like, we're just starting this whole new life, this whole new journey together. So it's just a lot to take on. But um, yeah, I'm, I am really excited about it. And for those of you who knew, I've been dealing with this chaos with this court for like two years uh, with this other girl. And they still send me mail for her. I don't know why we have different middle names. But hopefully adding on my husband's last name will solve that problem fingers crossed. But yeah, I just enjoyed watching this and enjoy my videos. I know this is a little bit different than what I normally do, but I would just figure this is 
my way of saying goodbye to this place. I did live here for four and a half years and it was much time for us to move on and get our own place. Um, I have kind of a love-hate relationship with this apartment, but there are things I'll miss about it, things I won't. Mostly things I won't. <laughs> um, we love our, our new place and stuff, but I don't know. I mean, it's still like a part of your life chapter that's closing. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Watch out for my next updates. I'll see you guys soon. Bye. Try and come back Saturday to get everything else in here. All that good stuff. This is it. <sighs> Took about a week to get everything, but we're officially saying goodbye to this space. Goodbye to this place one last time. So long. Farewell.